So I've been doing some research on the new third generation iPod Touch because, well, I want to know why there wasn't a video camera. Um, rumors practically confirmed it for practically a year before it came out. Um, cases with camera holes being cut out, applications being designed around the fact you could take pictures. Um, I was wondering, well, uh, why? Why wasn't there one? Why would the uh, iPod Touch's little kid brother, the Nano, get a video camera and not the iPod Touch? And from what I've read is, there was supposed to be a video camera, but a month before it came out, but before the September release, Apple had to nix the idea because they had some hardware, software compatibility issues, and so it wouldn't have been ready. Um, so they released this, September 9th, the third generation iPod Touch without a camera, to tide the market over with the new upcoming Zune HD. They had to release something for the market to buy. Um, but apparently, between November and February, they're going to release the new third generation iPod Touch with a built-in video camera. And chances are, they're not even going to tell us when this happens. We're going to start buying iPods and it's just going to have a camera built in. Frankly, I find it quite appalling that Apple wouldn't even tell anyone. In their defense, Microsoft was releasing a new Zune and they had to release something and telling the market, we're working on it, we don't know when it's going to be done, but we're working on it, probably went to flu, and they would have lost a lot of customers. But saying, here's a new one, we're going to have a better one coming up soon, may be better, because, well, I've been anticipating a new third generation iPod Touch myself for quite a few months. Um, and, I mean, I just spent over $300 on a new iPod, and, I mean, what part I was looking forward to most was the camera. So, I'm not, I mean, chances are maybe some people that bought these for the few months where they were out, free downloads from iTunes or something. Um, but if you haven't bought new iPod Touch and you're looking into it, I would suggest waiting a few months um, to avoid getting pretty much scammed out of $300 because Apple wasn't ready when they should have been. Um, Thanks.